facts about singer Katy Perry, including her age, true name, spouse, children, net worth, and career. One of the biggest stars of the past 15 years is Katy Perry. She has also consistently appeared in celebrity articles while balancing her responsibilities as a UNICEF Goodwill ambassador and LGBT campaigner with her day job. But how well-versed are you in Katy Perry and her impressive career to date? Do you know what her real name is, where she was born, or which Smurfs character she portrayed? Mary Christine and Morris Keith Hudson, two Pentecostal pastors, welcomed Katy Perry into the world on October 25, 1984 in Santa Barbara, California. The year 2022 saw her turn the age of 38. When she was a preteen, her parents relocated across the country before eventually moving back to Santa Barbara, where she attended Santa Barbara Christian School. Just as her career was about to take off, she would finally relocate to Los Angeles. In fact, Katy Perry's debut album was published under the name Katy Hudson. Katy Perry was given the name Catherine Elizabeth Hudson. When she began her career in the music industry, she used her mother's maiden name as her stage identity. Russell Brand, a comedian turned actor turned activist turned conspiracy theorist, and Katy Perry tied the knot in 2010 during a Hindu ceremony close to the Ranthambore Tiger Sanctuary in Rajasthan. It was one of the strangest celebrity marriages we can recall. In 2012, they got divorced. She started dating the actor Orlando Bloom in 2016, and as of February 2019, they are engaged. Daisy Dove Bloom, the couple's first child, was born in August 2020, according to Perry and Bloom. Katy Perry has broken a lot of records with her five top ten albums in more than a decade at the top of the pop world. A string of significant international arena tours was followed by her incredibly enormous Las Vegas play residency. Over $40 million is thought to have been made throughout the two-year period alone, and that will have contributed to her estimated net worth of $330 million. I Kissed a Girl debuted at number one in the UK and the US in 2008, following the eccentric and divisive or so gay EP, giving the impression that Katy Perry was a smash hit right away. Her seeming instant triumph, however, was a long time in the making, as is so often in the pop world. She took singing classes when she was nine years old, and until she was 17, she sung in her sister Angela's church. When Katie was 13, she also began singing and playing the guitar in front of an audience. After gaining some early experience, she quit Dos Pueblos High School to pursue a career in music. She completed her schooling in Nashville and released Katie, a Christian rock CD. She relocated to La the following year and switched from gospel to secular music while changing record labels. In 2005, a planned album for Island Def Jam subsidiary Java was postponed. The Columbia Records album Fingerprints was released the next year. Perry maintained a few of the tracks, but Kelly Clarkson ended up with I Do Not Hook Up and Long Shot, while Selena Gomez and The Scene received Rock God. She also collaborated with the Matrix production team at the time to record a number of tracks, which vanished for a while before being published in 2009. By then, Katy Perry had joined Capitol Records in 2007, released the One of the Boys album, I Kissed a Girl single, and her So Gay EP, and was finally a superstar. After releasing the dud Katy Hudson in 2001, Katy Perry finally found success with the 2008 release of One of the Boys. She then went on to release the US 9x Platinum Teenage Dream and the 5x Platinum Prism albums.